most of you will graduate. You have all trained in the Warrior's Way within the University of Dayspring for the past ten years. One final test remains for the brave souls who chose the path of the Dragon Rider. Find a suitable area in the forest to do your dragon summonings before the end of the week. Should you survive the summoning, and should a dragon respond to you, then you will return to the university, claim your badge, and you and your warrior dragon will serve the queen. Any questions? Good. You are dismissed. State your full name and extend your magic. Yes, yes. Hmm. You will do. Your call is answered. I am Viern, an armored platinum dragon of the Tirlog Mountains, daughter of Zekroya, the Shining One. I accept the bond of magic you offer, and come to you now from the realm of dragons. Now it appears that I am stuck. The standard portal is nowhere near big enough to accommodate the width of my wings, and there are far too many trees around. You need to create more space. I was planning on a grand entrance, which, I see now, will not be happening. I am only slightly disappointed. What do you mean I am larger than you expected? You should know never to say that to a female, lest she eat you up. Then it is fortunate, is it not, that I have chosen you as my rider? Fully grown platinum dragons of my line are all this size. I am still unable to squeeze through, 
your little portal. Please, remove the squirrel scampering around on my head. I am allergic to squirrels. Finally, success. Liberation from the tiny magical door has been achieved. Indeed. From today onwards, I shall be your dragon and you will be my rider. That is what answering your summoning entails. Perhaps not for other dragons, but that is how Platinum Warrior dragons work. Naturally, our work together will be for mutual benefit. You will lend me your powerful Earth Realm magic, and I will lend you my strength. Now, shall we solidify the bond of magic between us in the language of dragons? I trust you know the sacred words. Gaze into my mind stone. Open your heart and see yourself reflected in the light. Let us speak the words. Achri nasya und eschkach tiarchina und march garim bachri zilok na. Und es nairu kalachshar hin tu brachvanta si na yundor nar till death do us part. You are mine, and I your. And we will dominate the skies. Achra trihu, taera, und eshiabra, morandar, hishaisi. Is 
done. I smell something delicious. It is making me salivate. What is this? You have brought me a food offering. Ah, yes. So much food. The wagon was a good idea. Is the horse a food offering too, or...? <laughs> <laughs> of course. I was just making sure. Hmm. Do tell me about this offering. Ah. Uh. We do not have giant strawberries and star melon oranges in the dragon realm. Oh, I see. So it is a combination of human ingenuity, magic, and the crossbreeding of plants. <laughs> yes. Yes, very satisfying. Occasionally, I prefer something more meaty, but this is new. It is good. Now that the spectacle of my emergence has passed, <laughs> I do mean the word spectacle in both ways. Hmm. Would you like to hear more about me first, before we go on our flight? My name is Vierne, as I stated before. That is the short form. I was born in the Tyrolog Mountains, a place of ancient mysteries and untold wonders, all unblemished by the civilizations and histories and wars of humans. We dragons have had our squabbles in the past, but that is no more. We have united. Now we train to fight for those in need. That is why you summoned me, yes? <laughs> we have grown beyond the need for greed and fighting in our realm. It is simply unnecessary in a place where resources are abundant and we are not overpopulated. The dark abominations that once roamed there 
have been destroyed by us. <laughs> so we seek adventure, new skills, the taste of powerful human magic, even danger. It would be a shame if dragons were to just hide away, given how magnificently wonderful we are. Wouldn't you agree? <laughs> so we choose to come to the Earthen Realm and bond with humans. We share many stories of the Earthen Realm where I come from just as you share stories about dragons. It's been over 200 years since I was last here. That's why I decided to answer the call of the next dragon rider powerful enough to summon my company. Eh? Hey. You wish to know about my battle abilities? Of course. I am a fast and agile flyer, and I breathe blue flame. As you see, my wings and tail are tipped with lethal spikes, and my scales are incredibly strong, rendering me nearly impervious to harm. I'm sure you know, they are not actually made of platinum. That's just the name given to us due to the color of our scales. It is very easy to differentiate between a platinum and silver dragon. Those are smaller, for one, and less inclined to chew on your enemies. <laughs> hmm. Aside from that, I'm also fluent in many different languages. I can communicate with people and creatures. Tell me about yourself. Who do you fight for, and why do you fight? Hmm. I see. I will do my utmost to help you with your quest. Where do you want to go now? Yes. Ah, a splendid idea. Let us fly somewhere high where I can see your city and the forests surrounding it. There are bumps and hooks on my back you can hold on to. We'll fly back later for your horse. I hope your balance is good. Are you okay back there? While flying, you can communicate with me through my Mind Stone. It takes a little focus at first. You'll get used to it.
good. Now guide the way. <laughs>